Welcome back to International Scale Modeler, I'm Lee. Today we're going to do a review of these. <laughs> now, as you can see, uh, I've been uh, I've been collecting these for a little while now. Um, these are the amazing minions from a retro kit. Now we sell these on Ultimate Modeling Products, obviously. Uh, that's not the reason for me doing those, but I've realised that I've not done a review on these minions. So um, I thought I'd show you. Uh, I've been collecting these for three years now, ever since I, I met Domi up at um, Telford uh, one year, and. Uh, as you can see from the overhead, I do have a few of the minions. Now, I usually buy two or three at a time and I've been collecting and collecting for, as I say, three three years. I bought a couple at um, Telford and that was it, I'm hooked. And he brings out a lot each, he brings out every three months, he brings out, I think another well, five to 10 of them really. So uh, they're absolutely brilliant, but I mean, I've got, I think I've got 20 in total, 22, something like that. Um, and uh, there's over 60 already, but I know for, there's another six coming out in the next couple of months, and then there'll be loads more after that. But uh, his imagination is brilliant because Domi, uh, Domi actually comes up and sculpts these himself. I think he's got someone on board to help him now, uh, but he does do all these himself. So, very talented guy, um, and uh, we're very happy to be stocking these on Ultimate Modern Products now. We only stock stuff that we love on Ultimate Modern Products. Um, we've had uh, other companies and things that we've stocked, but really Retro uh, retro Kit and uh, you know the other companies that we've got, we really love them and that's why we stock them. So it's not just uh, all about the money. Um, but uh, as these, I just thought I'd show you what I've got. Um, and what I'll pull a couple of bags at random. I mean, they do things like these, this Mars Forever thing as well, which is, you know, lovely, if you've ever seen the cartoon, um, then uh, it's a Bugs Bunny and Daffy Duck cartoon. Uh, you'll know who this guy is on uh, this Mars Forever thing. And this, comes, uh, this one comes with a base, um, it's resin, and it's got a little metal thing in there as well. So very, very multimedia kits, and uh, a bit of everything. Um, and uh, they all, most of them come very well packaged, a lot of them come like this. Um, but you got these, I mean, uh, we'll go to the overhead so it'll be easier for me, but you got things like uh, you got a, a Darth, a Darth banana, which is fantastic. Friday, you know, Freddy banana. Um, you've got a Captain banana, uh, Spider Man, Terminator. Um, you got Norma's, You got an R two banana. As a Dalek one, I've got coming on the way. You have got like a screaming banana from Scream. Uh, you've got what's a bat, bat banana. You have got the Black Spider Man as well. Um, you've got Wolverine, uh, there's Freddy Krueger from Nightmare on Elm Street, uh, uh, you know, and you've got the normal minions from the film as well. And then you've got things like this, which is, this is another thing they do, they do lots of um, uh, Star Wars stuff, like they've got the Imperial Interpanji Reconnaissance Probe in 172 scale, something you'll not get anywhere else. Not massive, but that'll build up into a nice little kit, believe me. And uh, there's loads of other things they do, and you need to go onto umpretail.com and check out the full thing. We're, we're literally getting more and more every day from uh, from Domi. So um, there's absolutely tons to connect. And to be honest with you, once you start collecting them, you will be hooked. Um, I mean, I'm one, what I've got, I've got a plan to do five of these, uh, all the superhero ones. I've got Batman, Captain Banana, um, I've got Spider-Man. There's a couple more I want to get, Wolverine. Uh, and things like that, and do a little, a little uh, comic one, a little comic diagram with them all on and everything. So, but I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll, we'll move all of these over there, um, and I'm just going to zoom this overhead in a bit, just so you can see what's going on. And then I'll, let's pull out this. Let's say Captain Banana. Okay, so it comes in this little packet. Okay, which is just a little, little, uh, little block type bag with a little leaflet in it, and that's it. You don't need any instructions for these. I think they're quite simple to put together and quite uh, easy to understand to be honest with you. So on, on in here you've got uh, you've got the main character which is a solid lump of resin. Uh, now this lighter resin is meant to be the safer resin as well. So as you can see it's on a small resin block so you just need to, to cut that off there. Uh, it's probably whiting out a bit actually. Uh, just trying to see if I can I don't know but you can sit you can tell by the picture on the on the thing what it's going to look like. But you've got his banana there <laughs> And his shield, um, and it's the arms attached to the shield. And there's a bit of cleanup needed on there, as you can see from the resin. But absolutely, looks 
absolutely fantastic um, and great level of detail uh, these things have and it doesn't look much now but when they're made up they really do have character um, and uh, as I say uh, lots of people have these as mascots they have their favorite one they pick one do their favorite one and then uh, they'll uh, end up getting hooked and, and getting the rest I know I did uh, let's have a look at another one what we've got we've got the Terminator one here so let's have a look at this one uh, now this is obviously Arnold Schwarzenegger one, uh, I'll be banana it's called, I'll be banana. So we've got, get them out here, we've got, okay, some of them are in there quite well. Again this is a bigger lump, even bigger lump of resin, um, absolutely massive lump of resin this is, it's got a nice weight, very hefty. Now you can see the, the quite, I'll get you in a bit closer just so you can see the, the level of detail there. Okay, yeah absolutely. That camera for moving. Fantastic level of detail, all inside the eye and everything. You can see where he's had his face off, and underneath there, um, you can see he got a bit of a, his underskin and everything, and his face his expression is brilliant. Absolutely fantastic. Um, but uh, again, you can pin these, you know, the little feet here, and you just take this resin block off here, a little clean up here and there, and you can put some pins up through a base into those. And as I say, the wargaming pins, uh, the bases, little round bases are ideal for these. It'll be absolutely brilliant. But as you can see, the, the bandolier and the jacket, the creases, you know, everything. Fantastic level of detail all the way around. And uh, it has pockets on the jeans and everything. And you can tell that, uh, that Domi spent a lot of time and love and effort in creating these. Um, he obviously really does have a thing for it. And there's his, uh, his gun and everything as well. Again, that's fantastic detail there. Um, and it comes up really, really nice. Some great versions of this done, and then his arm. As you can see, there's not a lot of building on them. Um, there's not a lot to do build-wise. Uh, they are mainly, um, you know, pop them together, and uh, and they're more of a painting thing now. Figures, and because they're the the minions, that you don't have to be very highly skilled to do them. This is the thing. Um, because they're not going to be uh, look amazing, they can be quite cartoony, which uh, is another bit of the appeal. Um, you can make them as good as you want them to be, or you can have them as basic as you want to be. Because um, you know, on the cartoons, they're a little plain yellow with the colours of the clothing. You go to work on the clothing and things like that. Uh, I'm just trying to find another one with it, which is grey. Um, and this white stuff keeps what I think it waiting out. But have a look at the screen one. That oh, this is a dark one actually. Have a look at the dark, no, that's white. I'm trying to find a darker plastic that you can, um, you can see, oh, Freddy Krueger, this is a popular one. This this one, we're always selling out this one. Um, but as you can see, I'll bring you in again. As you can see, fantastic level of detail on the face and everything there, the skin. He's got that pizza face look. Uh, absolutely brilliant. And the hat is fantastic as well. Look. Really good, just just excellent quality all the way through. And obviously he's got his trademark hand there with the claws. Uh, just a little bit of tidy up needed on that, but absolutely brilliant work. Um, you got to take a hat off to Domi. I know he's got a little doll in his hand there. Look, <laughs> it's absolutely brilliant. The quality of that. that that doll is tiny and absolutely fantastic little quality on there. It's gonna come really nice indeed. So as you can see, uh, these things are. Um, very addictive. Uh, to be honest with you, you know, I haven't built one yet. I've just been collecting them um, because they're just, I, I want to get them if he ever stops doing them. So I've got them all, you know, um, but uh, they're absolutely brilliant. And I do recommend that anyone should go and get one um, and have a look, see what you think and paint one up. I, as I say, I want to do, th I want to do a superheroes one first off. That's my, um, my little plan for them, for the first ones. Uh, and then after that we'll see where we go. But there's there's so many to choose from. There's as I say, there's over you know 60 to choose from normally. Um, and I know that there's another six coming on. I think I think the total in about three or four months will be about 70 of them. So uh, I would definitely say that they, they, I think we are charging seven pounds ninety nine each for them. Go over, get one, try them out, see what you think, and I guarantee you you will be hooked and you will want to buy you know. It treats out to one every time you make an order on UMP or something like that. That I do. Uh, well, that's what I've been doing. Uh, I've been treating myself every time I go to Townford. I buy a few, and I've had a few each month of Domi because I've bought the the, X, the, um, the Snow Speeder and all that lot from him before as well. But 
these these little things are a total recommend for me. They're great to support a, a guy who does it all. His, does all this sculpting himself. Great little talent, and um, I take my hands off to Dobby. He's a nice guy as well. Uh, but uh, those are the retro retro kit uh, minions or bananas, as they're called, because of a trade stat, training trademark thing. Uh, but they are definitely worth getting. Get one, try one, see what you think. You'll be hooked. I know you will. Massive thumbs up from me. All right, until next time. Take care. Bye bye.